Good morning guys, welcome to today's video. Today, I have to tell you guys a crazy story. So you guys know that I'm contemplating getting another little dog. Just a tiny one, like a Chihuahua, or a Yorkie, or maybe even a Poodle. I we love get, Poodles. We, we should get a French Bulldog. I hate French Bulldogs. I love them, they're so cute. With their I love faces. French Bulldogs, I love all dogs, but a French Bulldog is not my kind of breed. You should get a Dalmatian. I would never get another Dalmatian. I love Daisy. Daisy is the most lovable dog in the history of she's the world. But she's very needy. She's very dramatic. She's very, <laughs> she's very, <laughs> crazy and I love a lot of those things about her but she's just she a went, lot of dog she went outside to go pee and she went pee so fast the fastest because there's it's snow cold the yeah I mean if there's snow she's unhappy and then she if it's cold she's around. unhappy if you don't throw her ball <laughs> anyway Daisy, you're making it hard to prove my point here. She's adorable. Baby I love her to a death, but she's not my kind of breed. So anyways, I'm trying to talk myself out of it. You guys know I don't want a dog. Like, I don't want to want a dog, but I need that mothering, like that cuddling, that, like I want to have a dog again. And I'm trying to put it out of my mind, and that's okay. What you don't know is that every January and every February, I spend hours cleaning the house. I spend so much time cleaning like the basement, and it's like my big spring clean is in January and February. Once the tree goes down, I clean and clean and clean. I go through stuff, I get rid of stuff. So this last month, I've been cleaning the basement, and it's an ongoing job, and every day, I clean out more buckets of stuff that we have stored down there. So the last few days, I have uncovered so many little outfits like this. I have a complete washing load of dog clothes right now. They're all in the washer. They all are little things like this. There's carrying cases. There's a pink carrying case for a little tiny chihuahua. Do you think Trixie could fit in it? I do not think Trixie could fit in it. Do you think Daisy could fit in it? This one might be for a doll. But it would totally fit. It would have fit Macy for sure. But anyway, I have all these things in the wash and I, everywhere I go, I keep seeing all these like signs that I should be getting a small dog. I don't want to want one and, but I'm feeling like the desire more and more and more. I'm feeling the push to go out there and get one. I found a Yorkie that I love, but I would have to pay for it and order it and it would have to be shipped and I don't like shipping dogs even though it's possible I just don't want to put them through that if I can rescue a dog or I can um find one closer to me that needs that needs me so I've decided to do what some of you guys have said and let the dog come to me I've put out all the feelers I've looked around I've told the people in my life that work with dogs and deal with dogs and and have access to finding dogs that I'm interested and one will find me if it's meant to be that's all I know but oh, the feeling is so hard, you guys. I'm so conflicted. Should I get one or should I not? It's bright out there, you guys. It's winter. It's finally winter. I can't believe it. Whoa, look at snow everywhere. Woo! Yeah, it was winter a month ago. I got a banana for the horse's drink. All right, let's try it. It seems like in every video, Gabby's a slave. Yeah. But look at how clean it looks in here. Yeah, clean. We have a banana. No, 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 you leave it closed. No. Yeah, horses. Not how it yes, no, 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 Sophie, don't. Because they won't eat the skin by itself, but they enjoy the skin if it's with, uh. Well, they can't eat this part. Okay, so hold the other end to them. I've always wanted to try it this way. She just got the banana. <laughs> because you opened it. All right, let's try the baby. The, well, I'm just gonna get the rid baby, of the banana baby. part because this part's too thick. Pony, 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 <laughs> following her on horse. <laughs> stop, she's pinning her ears because of Gracie. Gracie, stop it. She doesn't know how to eat. She's like, I don't know if I really like it. Gracie. She's okay. like, what do you have? I'm giving Gracie a bite. All right, leave the skin on. She likes it. All right, we got the ponies in the arena. I have a lot I want to do in the barn today, and it's colder today, but it's actually still really nice. Like. 
Even though we got a ton of snow, it's still beautiful outside. A little bit of snow inside. Those things up there, the, the crease down the middle, I don't even know what it's called. I'm not into that kind of stuff. But it allows snow to, to fall through into our arena. So usually there will be like a line of snow or a line of rain in our arena. But today I wanted to do some work with the mares. And I wanted... She has a snowball. Gabby, don't throw snowballs. Do not throw snowballs. Yeah, I don't want another headache. Yeah, we don't want headaches. We don't want concussions. Snowballs can get concussions. I've already had two concussions. You know Gabby's devilish when she's got that look. That's the look. No. Why she's smiling? <laughs> she's devilish. And what's really funny she's about Gabby me. is that she's super fem. Oh. What the flip? No. What the flip? <laughs> All right. Are we done? Gabby, no. Gabby, no throwing snowballs. She hit my knee. Yeah, Hands off policy, knee. sister. Don't do it. Oh. Gabby, I will take you down. You guys want me to take her down? I will take you down. I'm a lot bigger than you. Yeah, I know that. I know that already. Don't do it. Don't do it. Gabby! Don't run. The boards are frisky today because it's all snowy. So. <laughs> Honey's like, I want in on this. The other horses ran for it. And the, and the ponies are like, yeah, I'm in. Or the mini is like, I'm in. So for today's video, what I want to do is I want to train our horses to stop and stay. It should be easy. Our horses are so used to being handled. Stay. <laughs> All right, so Honey will be like, you can pick between Willow or Honey for this activity. You, you always step on the poles. What do you want to, who do you pick? Both. All right, we'll pick one to do it first. All right, so for this activity, this exercise, we're gonna need these. We're gonna need what? These. Uh-oh. Yeah, give me mine. All right, which one's yours? Not the beautiful pink one. <laughs> You're taking mine. No, I'm having mine. These two are mine. It's a fighting day. Stop, <laughs> Sophie. Mean. This is the one I love. I got it for Christmas. I've been wanting this. I've never had one of these before. Yeah, you used to use mine. This black one is Gabby's. Wizard. All right, here, Gabby. Come on, honey. Okay, listen, Gabby. Yeah, Gabby. Stop. 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 <laughs> Did you have coffee? I've forbidden Gabby to have coffee. Did you have coffee? Do not give a Gabby, a coffee Gabby, a crop. Look at this horse couldn't care less about a crop. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna get our horse to walk with us and we're gonna walk with them beside them. When we get to the wall, we're gonna stop and we're gonna say stop and we're gonna raise our hand with our crop for a visual. You can use your hand instead if you don't wanna use a crop. Crops are like kind of traditional. Okay, so one thing you guys don't know about Honey, because she seems so agreeable always, is that she's scared of Gabby and Sam. She doesn't know them the way that she's she knows me and Sophie. She just doesn't like it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, look, she did it. She did it. She closed herself into the wall. Look. Stop. Okay, so is that what you're No, so Sophie. Because I'm to do up and What the heck is in your pocket? Okay, so I'm going to show you guys with, with Penny, Penny Pickle. Beautiful Penny Pickle. I'm not explaining it to them what I want them to do, but I want them to teach the, the, the horses to stop. I think that's what it is. I don't know. But anyways, let's go. Okay. I can't get up alone. Too heavy on my own. The world is moving on. Yeah, but Gracie did the same thing. Without me having to put my arm up or say, whoa. Well, so I think I already won. I swear. If you All right, I want to see you guys do it. You can use a lead rope if you have to. Because okay. after we do that, Wait, we're going to... Wait, be in my space. So. After okay. we do that, I'm going to try and get them to stay. Okay. So I want them to stay. 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 No, I could be oh. doing the same exact thing with my dog. Good girl. See? Oh, the problem is, is that 
I watch a video and get, or someone tells me how to do something, or I watch a video, and then I come down here and I'm ready to do it, and it never seems, yeah, like I can't kidding. remember how it's supposed to look. A professional whip holder? I'm still standing here Searching for steady ground A place to settle down left to find one day I'll change your mind and it won't come easy but I know it's worth the fight she literally stepped forward yeah but you know what I want to reward her for trying because it's hard for her to understand exactly what I'm asking for especially when I don't know this very well myself. This kind of stuff gets me so excited, you guys. Like, I love it. And I know it's not what you guys necessarily want to see, especially Ready? because I make a lot of mistakes. Ready? But mistakes just mean learning. Okay. Yeah. Penny's like, fine, I'm gonna, she's going to poop. I know my horse, she's going to poop. They always poop down there. I know, okay. Penny's like, I'll just push something. <laughs> She loves that. Like, Penny's thing is she loves pushing things. Like, she does it even if nobody's around. Like, she, we keep these balls in here just for her. No, honey, don't. I also wanted to tell you guys that, that um, for the, our new upload schedule, like our new schedule, you guys know we used to post like a lot of riding videos and stuff. It's winter. This is the first year we're not riding as much. Not from our fault, but because we brought our horse home and because we brought it home home, it's just, it's not easy to get into the riding arena all the time. Our new upload schedule will be, every week we'll have our daily videos like normal. And then I'm hoping to have one challenge video and I have a really fun one for next week. One challenge video and a riding video with Gabby and a riding video with Sophie each week. So those are three nighttime videos that you guys can look for. Um, I don't know the exact dates. I think it's gonna be like Thursday night. I think it's gonna be like Monday night, Thursday night, and Saturday night. I don't know, something like that. But anyways, hopefully we'll have three videos, extra videos for you guys where you'll be able to see riding or a challenge. She just moves her front. I know, I forget how you're supposed to. I never knew how I was supposed to, so. Hey there, no, stay, stay, stay. Stay, stay, stay. Okay, stay with her, stay she, with her, lay down with her. She has, where you can actually see the skin on her belly, um, she has spots. Does she have spots on her belly? Yeah. So. Sure. So her parents are Blanca Appaloosa. Anyways, we looked at pictures of her and she is covered in spots. So when she sheds out, she should be covered in spots. Her legs particularly, in particular, but all over her body. We get so excited when we are like we're so excited about the opportunity to see spots see on her do you guys see any spots no you can't there's too much hair oh well, where did you see the spots right there oh, do you guys see them i think i see spots she's got modeling all over in all the right areas so we know she's gonna have spots and before she got her winter coat we saw that she had spots so we're really excited about that. Usually in the winter time, I do a segment where I do work with Penny because I really feel the groundwork in my heart. Like I wanna do like structured groundwork, stuff that makes a difference, stuff that like helps us when we're riding. And I plan to ride a lot this spring and this summer and I'm, we're gonna go out next weekend. So I also wanna put like a segment of me and Penny. Just gently wiggling the lead rope. She's not like yanking it or putting pressure anywhere. Sometimes it's hard to make a video. Like the struggles with videoing us working like this is that you obviously you make a lot of mistakes before you do it the right way and you need to practice and get a feel for it. And so us trying to film it while we're doing that isn't good. It's better if we film it after so you guys can see the success because a lot of people have a really hard time seeing like the journey to get to the success. But on our channel, I really believe in showing the journey and showing the mistakes because that is how you learn. You can't learn without mistakes. And you can't learn without practicing. You can't learn without <laughs> just pretending to be honey. 
So I want you guys to hold me accountable for me having time to work with Penny. Last year I did it by myself in the arena, by myself. I. I decided what we were gonna do each time and it came down it was just Penny and I. I'm gonna do that again because this is what I love. This is what like makes me so excited. So um every week I'm gonna do a video of just me and Penny. Anywhere with you I won't give up I'll take my chances and I will follow you guys know that we are trying to find a new farm and we've been looking and looking but we're being really picky about what we want and today I found one that I really am interested in and we're doing a drive-by we're doing a drive-by have you guys ever done that we, we want to drive by and see if we like the area and see if we like the house and we see if we like the way it looks we don't usually do that unless we really like the house and I really like this house do you like this house now it needs a lot of work though I love that it needs a lot of work. Like a lot of houses, I don't want to do the work that it needs. Like if the layout is funky, then it stresses me out. But if the layout is is like this house, this house doesn't stress me out. And I love the layout of the land. And it's a lot of acres. And there's another thing. I'm not going to probably show you the house because unless I don't like it and I'm not considering it, I might show you the house. But I'll show you one thing about the house for sure. This house has every single thing on our list except for woods it doesn't have woods to to ride in but it has so much property you could ride anywhere on the property that you wanted to but it has one other thing that we want even more than woods that most other properties don't have that's the lake isn't that cool don't you know that you're beautiful just the 